What's up? Tyler from Plugged On. I'm here with an album review. This time I'm going to talk about the new album from Dragon Lord entitled Dominion. Uh, Dragon Lord is a symphonic black metal project from Eric Peterson, who is the guitar one of the guitar players of Testament. Um, Dragon Lord was around in the early 2000s. They put out two albums, and now they are back with a new one. It's been 13 years, I believe, since the last one. Um, I'll be honest. I've I've have never listened to Dragon Lord before. I've heard of them, just never never listened to them. But n- just hearing that they were putting new music out, I'm like, fuck it, I'll give it a shot. And uh, I'm very glad I did because I very much enjoy this this album. So uh, before it was formed by uh, Steve Smith of Nevermore was in the band, um, and then there was another member of Testament that I'm blanking on uh, that was in the band as well. But now Eric Peterson's here. He's got Alex Ben on drums who played with Trivium and Archaic and all sorts of bands, um, and he's got uh, and he's doing most of the vocals. Uh, or all the vocals. Uh, he's got some female vocals here. Um, all I could find uh, is that her name is Leah. Um, so yeah, lot, lots of cool stuff going on here. Uh, it starts off with uh, after entrance, which is an interesting intro. Uh, you get the title track Dominion, which they released uh, as the first single, and uh, very very catchy opening guitar riff. I, I love it. And then I also what I enjoy about this is that. Uh, you know the symphonic bits are really well done uh but then i love the parts where they kind of get to a more simple rhythm and then some clean vocals come in and that that happens throughout a few tracks on here uh and i think the you know, the dynamic between the uh screamed vocals and the clean vocals really work well and and you know i i love how they're they're used very very thoughtfully in a way you know uh, and Dominion has has some of that. I mean, it has a lot of good riffage, good symphonic stuff, good stuff that would make you go. Um, even though I enjoyed it, I wish the new Demu Borgir album sounded like this. It, it's very much in the vein of that sort of symphonic black metal sound that um, I feel De, Demu uh, very much does very well. Um, you know, and they've kind of very uh, moved away from that. Uh, but yeah. Anyways, uh, Ominous Premonition is another fantastic track, more uh, kind of in-your-face sort of song. My favorite track is, is uh, La Mia, which uh, has an v- amazing middle section with uh, female clean vocals. And then Eric Peterson comes back later with uh, some more fantastic clean vocals. But then also, there's just really great... Uh, guitar leads going on there it's it's just really good that that track as a whole is is definitely my favorite track on here um you can very much tell if you've listened to a lot of testament that eric peterson is in the band writing these riffs because uh, a lot of these riffs are very much some testament riffs uh, not not a lot of them but some of them definitely are ominous premonition starts off and you're like yeah i could see that being used in, in a testament song uh and then just some of the rhythms uh the way the rhythms work with the drum work a lot of times is very much a testament sort of thing and even eric's clean vocals sometimes i'm like damn is chuck billy singing i don't know <laughs> who knows uh love with the damned is more of a cleaner more ballad song with primarily clean vocals on it that i thought worked very well i thought it was a i love where it's put in the album you know you get three of the more aggressive in your face songs uh with lots of melodies in it and then love of the damned kind of breaks that up and then you get three more of those tracks to finish the album so very very uh well done there with the pacing of that for sure um and then you know the final three tracks are just awesome to listen to especially serpents of fire uh that ends it uh is eight minutes long it goes to a lot of different places has a lot of fantastic riffs in it uh, and, and, and does a great job closing the album. Overall, I mean, I, I enjoy this a lot. Um, I, I would recommend if you're definitely a fan of symphonic black metal sound, um, especially like 2000s Dimu Borgir, um, check this out because uh, I think it can be right up your alley. Like if you um, wish that Dimu would go back to like Death Called Armageddon, then listen to this album. <laughs> Uh, stuff like that um uh, overall fantastic job by eric peterson i hope he puts out more music uh under this label um because i would certainly dig the shit out of it probably 
so yeah, check it out. Dragon Lord, I'm going to give this an 8.5 out of 10. It's cool uh, with Dominion. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. See ya.